Namaste guys. In this video, we are going to learn how to remove duplicate character from a string in Java. Okay, so let's start. So let's create our string that basically, you know, I want to remove character from. Let's say my string name is S and it is the string C A D B E. Okay. If someone is thinking, hey, that I can use for loop, uh, I recommend don't use for loop. Okay, only by using only for loop, that will not going to work. You will face a lot of issues. So we are going to use something called hash map. And let's see how does it work. So first thing that we are going to get is hash map. So hash map. So it is going to take what kind of data? It is going to take a character and integer. Let's say it is map new hash map. Okay. After that, I'm going to store all my string to a new string. Let's say string. The, its name is answer and it's an empty string. Now, what I'm going to do is as I have to remove duplicate character from a string, so I need to convert this string into a something called character array. Okay. So let's see how to do it. So let's create a first char array. So char uh, input. Okay. S dot. What I want to convert it. I want to convert my string into array. So there's an inbuilt function called to char array. So simply click on it and semicolon. Now for int i equal to 0. i less than input dot length. I plus plus. Don't worry if you are not understanding the code. I will explain later on words. Okay. So if map dot contains key input i, then we are going to put input i and its value going to be 1 and answer will be answer plus input i else i will simply do map dot put input i comma 1 in simple words i'm going to do nothing okay uh, after that what i'm going to do is i will type system dot out dot print what i'm going to print my answer so if i press ctrl s and click on run you can see all the duplicate characters is removed now a main question so how it works actually what actually happened behind the scenes that it works okay so let's try to understand so i'm opening my whiteboard so for those who don't know what is a hash map so hash map is like uh array array okay but hash map is uh, special in array what actually happens that you have a something called indexing zero and in front of it it's a value okay uh, but in hash map what actually happens your indexing it not start with 0 1 2 you basically specify the data type and you base indexing based on your data for example in array your indexing data type is always integer data type 0 1 2 3 4 okay it uh, it is not going to be character boolean or anything else okay in hash data type you can choose whether your indexing data type is character or you know boolean float etc so it's up to you so what actually happening i create a hash map okay which is some, something like array but it is special type of okay so what i'm saying hey uh i have a string called s a a b b c a d b e okay so i'm saying hey uh that uh, when I run this for loop, okay, I will first see that 
on my you know hash map data is their input i uh, at current time my map is empty so it's a hey there is no, nothing so i will get a that is my index value right now index and its value going to be one why one because i am defining its value so index and its value is one okay remember when input i is enter okay what is input i i first convert string string into char array so these things will convert into array so they are indexing like 0 a 1 a 2 b 3 b 4 c and so on so what i have done is that convert i convert char input into array and i am starting these value putting into my map okay so i'm saying hey a and its value 1 since i also said that if this loop is going to work add this value to my answer string so answer now will contain a okay now when this loop will run again now i value becomes 1 okay now it see that hey a, one value is a and a is already here so it will go to the else and see that i simply said hey do nothing basically means hey that go to index a and make its value one okay so i basically i'm doing nothing here so i will go back and now the value becomes two now is b in my here index the answer is no so i will add b and put its value one okay and this line will run so it will become b are you noticing that because of my indexing okay hash map i am not able to take the repeated characters or duplicate characters in my hash map so in that way when the this loop runs you can see b is already there so what we have to do is simply b hence value 1 so nothing will happen again so as you can see else loop will run because this loop will not run if if uh, if loop because the map contains already b so it's go to the else and it's just do the same thing so nothing is happening and similarly this process go on and you will get your answer okay so i hope you understand this if you have any kind of doubts and queries feel free to ask and make sure that you check out my blog link in description to understand how does this code work Thanks for watching and have a great day.